Hey everyone, welcome to DJ's Game Box. I am on the Grocery Gang official website and I found something pretty cool. Uh, if you look at this uh, menu and you go down to activities, um, there are a couple things you can do here. Um, you can get uh, this what do you call it? Computer wallpaper. There's a background. Um, you can get a phone wallpaper. There's this grotty games ideas of games you can play. And there's also, can you find the trashed cans? Um, so let's try this grotty games and see what this is all about. So let's hit download. And what it is, is it's kind of like a poster, and it has these ideas of these games you could play um, with your toys. So I'm going to read these to you, and then you can see what these games are talking about. So, um, what you do is, you, the first one is, throw up with sticky soda. It's game one. So you place a sticky soda can a set distance away from you. Take it in turns to throw a grocery into the can. Ten points are awarded for every grocery you get in the can. Minus one point for every grocery that misses the can. Be the first person that gets to 50 points and you get to stick it to your friends. So that's a game for two plus players, okay. Well, let's look at game number two. It's Smash and Crash Sale. This is for two plus players also. Players place as many sticky soda cans as they wish in front of them. Then each player takes turns to knock down the opponent's cans. The player who knocks down all their opponent's cans first wins the game. Clean up in aisle five. All right, let's check out number three. Game three is for two plus players also. It's called Crate Knockdown Prices. You stack as many crates on top of each other as you can with grocery in each. Take turns trying to bounce a character into the tower to make it tumble. The person who makes the crate tower tumble wins the game. Can you make the best looking mess? Hmm. And game number four, Foul Goal Challenge, the exciting game for two or more players. Each player sets up a goal by placing two crates 20 centimeters apart as shown below. Players then take turns trying to flick a grocery from their foul line through their opponent's goal. The first player to score five goals is the winner. For an added challenge, make the goal smaller. Alright, so those are some kind of fun ideas of some games you could play with your grocery gang toys. Um, so, thanks for watching DJ's Game Box. Thank you for subscribing.